Hi, it's Tom Monson, producer of Kickin' Butts. Thanks for stopping by. Another average American day. Communities across the country leading their lives, chasing their dreams. Yet, hiding beneath this idyllic surface lies a deadly secret, which controls the lives of over 47 million American men, women, and children, hooked on a drug that causes more death and disease than all other drugs combined. How could I live with myself even now, thinking that if I died of cancer and my daughter had to live with that? I made this film because I wanted to help people quit smoking. The reasons people smoke are as very... Our first goal was to help people understand why they smoke. Their addiction is a direct result of the world's largest, longest, and most successful marketing campaigns ever devised. We do not add or otherwise manipulate nicotine to addict smokers. And we also let them hear what Big Tobacco has to say. It does not convince me that uh, uh, smoking causes death. Little is being done to help. And I was really lucky to find Diane. If people died in plane crashes, it's frequent. It's also a big help to hear from so many professionals, including addiction specialists, well, physicians. In many ways, nicotine is the perfect drug, except that it kills you. And former smokers. It gives the viewer a real look at what to expect when they quit smoking. Days, I gave myself permission to do anything I wanted as long as it wasn't to smoke. If people can stop smoking, they're going to live so much longer and so much better. I felt the best way to help was to show that it's possible to quit by following someone else as she quits. The moment of truth. It won't be without struggles. For Diane, the next 72 hours will be filled with cravings, anxiety, and nervous tension. Turn your car and you're blowing the smoke out. Your kids are sucking that stuff in. I had to try and start my paperwork without going anywhere or doing anything. Diane is exhausted, yet confident and hopeful about the future. I feel okay right now. And one of the keys to success is knowing what's going to happen. It helps people to prepare. It was pretty hard. Just kind of, just a little irritating. I've asked you to do it 50 times. So it's right there. Diane's having a lot of different uh, mood changes, you know, real rapidly. I'm going to go to, um, group of ex-smokers. This film also presents the tools that people need to have to quit smoking. Ideas. Support and understanding are important when battling nicotine withdrawal. And most communities have smoking cessation support groups. Two of the best and most useful tools Diane learned about were the rule of halt and the four Ds. Diane is lucky to have a loving and supportive family. A family will also gain valuable insight about how to support someone who is quitting. I'm on my way. I'm on my way to getting over it. I mean, if I've gone four days, why turn back? As this story progresses, we see how Diane starts to build confidence in her decision to quit. Because of what she has learned and experienced during the last 72 hours, she has mastered how to put out your last cigarette. When you're young like, like these teenage girls, you don't really... This is a wonderful story. And you know, seeing someone else succeed helps us believe that we can succeed too. I, I was a teenager when I started smoking, really. And it was this great thing that, that I didn't think I would ever really even want to quit. And all those years I kept saying, well, I don't want to quit. And then it came to a Kick and Butts has been used extensively by smoking cessation groups all around the world to help people successfully put out their last cigarette. I am so glad that I quit. I am so glad because I do so much more activities with them now than I did before. Instead of sitting around smoking cigarettes, I get up and I play. You can order Kickin' Butts at lifeisgreatproductions.com. Thanks again for stopping by. <laughs>